What's up guys, Shine here, and today we are going to be doing a display and speed comparison between the flagship Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra and the flagship killer Poco F3. Talking about specifications, the Samsung S21 Ultra we have here comes with an Exynos 2100 chip, along with 12GB of RAM and 256GB of UFS 3.1 storage. The phone has a Quad HD 6.8 inch HDR10 plus 120Hz AMOLED display with a max brightness of 1500 nits. The POCO F3 on the other hand comes with a Snapdragon 870 with 6GB of RAM and 128GB of UFS 3.1 storage in this particular model. There is a version available with 8GB of RAM and 256GB of storage as well. The POCO has a full HD 6.67 inch HDR10 plus 120Hz AMOLED display with a max brightness of 1300 nits. That being said, let's get into the display comparison. As far as the display quality on both of the phones goes, I can virtually tell no difference between the two displays in real life, other than the fact that the S21 Ultra display is ever so slightly brighter. That being said, let's move on to the speed test now. Samsung opened it faster. Samsung opened phone app faster as well. And it also opens messages faster. Camera opened up at the same time on both. Samsung opened the ROS faster. Poco opened Food Panda faster. They both opened Chite at the same time. Samsung opened Block Drive faster. Um, Samsung opens Geometry Dash slightly faster. Samsung opens Asphalt 9 slightly faster. Poco opens PUBG slightly faster. Samsung opened WhatsApp faster. It also opens Netflix at a faster rate. Poco opens YouTube faster. They both open Twitch at roughly the same time and Samsung opens settings faster. So that's the end of the first round. We have six gigabytes on the Poco and 12 on the Samsung, so it should be a very clear win for Samsung in round two. So let's just get into it. They both have it in memory. They both have it in memory. Both phones have PUBG in memory. as well as Asphalt 9 and Geometry Dash is in memory for both as well as Block Drive and Chite and Food Panda uh, they were both in memory but Poco took some time to open it Poco does not have camera in memory It did not have messages in memory either, or the phone app, but it seems to have clock in memory. So with that being said, 
the Samsung did win the speed test because it opened most apps at a slightly faster rate with Poco opening lesser apps faster and because of the difference between the 12 and 6 gigabytes of RAM the Samsung managed to keep all of the apps in memory that being said in this particular test with this amount of apps I'm pretty sure the 8 gigabyte version of Poco would also keep all of the apps in memory but otherwise for general multitasking 12 gigabytes on the Samsung is better that being said guys I really hope you enjoyed the video Please like and subscribe for more content just like this. I have a camera comparison between the two phones coming out in the next couple of days. So stay tuned for that. Anyways, guys, thank you. Peace.